Hi, and welcome to House Blend on SCV TV, where local musicians of all persuasions come to play their original material. And you and I get to know them a little bit better when they join us for some conversation. I'm Stephen K. Peoples, your House Blend host. Thanks for dropping in. Now, in a memorable recent edition of House Blend, it was our great honor to present country rock and bluegrass legends Chris Hillman and Herb Peterson as a duo. Well, now for the next half hour, we're equally delighted to welcome Herb back to the House Blend set with his quartet, the, tr the uh, traditional bluegrass and old-time music group known as Loafer's Glory. We'll hear the world premiere of a, some songs from their first album. Welcome to House Blend, Herb and Loafer's Glory. Thank you. Nice Thank to be here. You. Please introduce yourselves. Herb Peterson, and I play guitar. Okay. Bill Bryson, bass and vocals. Patrick Sauber, banjo and mandolin. Okay. And Tom Sauber, uh, fiddle, and mostly. Banjo. And banjo. <laughs> and banjo. Don't forget it now. Now, you guys have been together only a couple of years, but right. collectively you have, what, 320 years of experience? Oh. So. Yeah. Many, many. <laughs> Is that what it adds up to? <laughs> yeah. It's something like that. Well, you're yeah. all highly skilled veteran musicians, right? Yeah. yeah. So, so uh, and even, even the, uh, the Sauber folks back there. So um, how did this group come together in this particular form? I have no idea. Well, I do. You know? Okay. Well, then you, you tell us. Yeah. Tom and, we, Tom and I were, we were playing a casual with uh, some other folks, and we were sitting backstage, and Tom said it would be great to get Herb to sing some old-time music. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and uh -huh. so we... We, get, we put something together. We put a, it was a dream. It was a dream. Okay. I have a dream. Okay. And, it's, uh, and we got together, and it, and it worked out just fine. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. You're going to buy that, Herb? Yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 that's it, what's it, offered. It, yeah. <laughs> and, and the thing that I, what, what I liked about it was the fact that the first time we got together, uh, we played some tunes, and it just sounded like we'd been together for a long time. I mean, it just had that nice pocket, and... It just sounded really good. Right. Now, you yeah. recorded your first album uh, in Sherman Oaks over the hill. How did it, how did it, uh, how difficult was it to choose the tunes you wanted to perform? I mean, uh, out of all of the material in the world you could have chosen. Right. Well, we have right now about 95 songs that we've worked up, tunes, fiddle tunes and all that. And we had just been playing so many shows that we just got real comfortable with certain ones, and those are the ones that we decided to do. And we also wanted to re-record re a a lot of us have, have recorded our original songs with other bands, and we yeah. wanted to re-record them with this outfit, too. Yeah. Gotcha. So, so we, had right. a lot, we had a lot of stuff to work with. Yeah. Well, we're going to hear uh, one of them from the, uh, from the new album right now, and uh, tell us about it. What's the first song? Tom. Crow it's a fiddle tune called Crow Little Rooster, and I actually learned it from uh, uh, an old-time uh, fiddler uh, who grew up in Oklahoma, and he came out here uh, during the 30s with all the uh, thousands and thousands of other Okies, and I learned to sort of play most of my fiddling from him. Fantastic. Well, 60s. bring it forward. Yeah. Pass it on, right? <laughs> yeah. Well, here's Loafer's Glory right now on House Blend with Crow Little Rooster. <laughs> Glory and Crow Little Rooster. That's the lead-off track from the band's eponymous debut album out in May 2012. 
I'm Stephen K. Peoples, your House Blend host on SCV TV. We're back on the set with the members of Loafers Glory Herb Peterson, Bill Bryson, Tom Sauber, and Patrick Sauber. Now, Herb, in the liner notes for the first Loafer, Loafers Glory album, mm -hmm. you talk about uh, wanting to pass on the uh, things that you've learned from the masters. Right. Tell us a little bit about that. What, what masters are you talking about, and what is it you, you want to pass on? Well, I originally came from bluegrass music. Bill Monroe, Lester Flatt and Earl Scruggs, and the Stanley Brothers. And so those, those were the core bands that I listened to as a kid, 17, 18 years old. <clears throat> and so that was my first you know, outing as far as traditional roots country music. And uh, I just never got tired of them because they were so good at what they did. And so Bill came up the same way, listening to old-time music and more than I did, uh, and uh, so it's kind of a, a uh, just a blending of old time and bluegrass, what we're trying to do. Now, and Tom, back here, he is uh, just a, a walking library of old time music. He knows a lot about it, and uh, he brought uh, the next tune, Let Me Fall, to the project and wanted me to sing it, so I'm singing lead on this. Very good. Well, yep. Tom, tell us about Let Me Fall. What's the story behind the track? Well, actually, Bill and I, years ago, started playing old time, started playing old time music with a, a banjo picker who lived down in San Pedro. He worked as a longshoreman, but he grew up in the Blue Ridge Mountains of North Carolina, and his name was Ed Lowe, and this is a tune that uh, came from there, that part of the country. All right. Ned Lowe was essentially a surrogate grandfather to Patrick as he was growing up. There you go. <laughs> so passing it on again. There you right? go. <laughs> okay. Well, let's hear it right now. Here's Loafer's Glory on House Blend and Let Me Fall. It's Loafer's Glory on House Blend and a song from the quartet's 2012 debut album on our Hooli titled simply Loafer's Glory. I'm Stephen K. Peoples, your House Blend host on SCV TV, and we'll be back with more Loafer's Glory right after this quick break. Vincenzo's New Hall offers the best value and great tasting pizza for all of the Santa Clarita Valley. From the freshest toppings and savory sauce to expertly hand-tossed pies, Vincenzo's New Hall offers terrific service, ice-cold drinks, fresh salads, and of course, great-tasting handmade pizza. 
Vincenzo's features Friday night karaoke. Saturday night, it's live bluegrass featuring the Grateful Dudes and Sunday, the only live local rock and roll. Vincenzo's New Hall invites you to dine in or try their takeout or let us come to you with our rapid and friendly home delivery. Vincenzo's New Hall, inch for inch, the best pizza in the Santa Clarita Valley. <laughs> 